will take you to whichever time I choose. Find the Nidus. Bring it to me. You will only see it in reflection, shining brightly. To retrieve the Nidus, you must form a circle round it. Then you will link hands and think of my eyes. Think of my eyes. Concentrate. anything. There is something. Hey! Stop! There was somebody. Did you see him? Who? A sort of old monk. What was he doing? Nothing. That's what's so odd. When he saw me, you ran off. Oh, so he's not belligerent. What's that? Somebody who fights. Well, sort of. I mean, he didn't try to do any harm. No. It might have been Rothko. Rothko wouldn't run away. Depends who he is in this time. All the same. We've got to look for him. He's got to be about here somewhere. It's a dungeon by the look of it. You wait back in the tunnel. Why? In case anybody comes, you can warn us. <laughs> Helen? Helen? Helen, where are you? Hey, you two. What are you doing here? What is the matter? Intruders, my lady. Two children. Children? Hunt them down and bring them here to me. I shall, my lady. Ah, Rothko. Your children cannot help you now. I will conjure a false image of your very self as you are in this time. To confuse them utterly. They will believe it is truly you. Only I will know it to be a creature of Bellor's own will. Helen! Where are you? Stop! In the name of the sheriff, I order you to stop! Stop! I order you to stop! We're trapped. A blackamoor. <laughs> In you go. Now, get in there, Saracen spies. I'll get the sheriff. We haven't done anything. Her ladyship's orders. There's likely to be a reward for this, or at the least, promotion. We've got to get out of here and find Helen. I know. The question is, how? Do you think he could help? Do you think he'd still be in here if he could? No. We'll have to try and call Rothko. With just the two of us? It's worth a try. OK. Link hands. Rothko. 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 
good I found. Are you mad, Robin? Hold your tongue, woman. What we need is food for ourselves, not another mouth to feed. Get rid of her. Get rid of her? Don't you know who she is? Trouble, that's who she is. This is the sheriff's niece. What? She's valuable, Marion. Oh, she's only a girl. How do you know she's his niece? Well, I found her in a cave up by the castle. Who else would she be? He's arranged the rich marriage for her. And what do you think he might pay to uh, get her back safe, eh? A gold medallion, perhaps? Maybe. Please. Oh, so you found your tongue, you my pretty. What's your name? Helen. But please... Helen? Yes, and I'm not the sheriff's niece. Not? Well, then who are you? Just Helen. Nobody important. I was with my brother and our friend. Well, you're Norman. No, I'm English. Fool. Where's your home, girl? Long way. Long way. You have got a home? Yes, of course. Hmm. Are you hungry? Not really. What is it? Rabbit. I used to eat venison. That was when... When you could shoot. When you were younger. There I could shoot a stag at half a league. My men and I would dare anyone to come through the forest. You robbed the rich to feed the poor? Oh, we robbed everyone. Escort or no. Noble or clergy. You're Robin Hood. Me? The one the minstrel singer. Oh, bless you, girl. That one's nothing but a legend. There are tales of him all round these parts. I've been for many a year. My Robin is Robin of Loxley. Once the most feared outlaw in these parts. The one who gained, then lost an earldom. I could have been a legend. Ah. Tell you lost your skills. That's not my fault. Best check your snares, my love. Now the mouth to feed. Rothko. Rothko. We can't raise him with just the two of us. Oh, Rothko. Yes. Rothko. Yes. Hello. Then you know who you are. Of course. Who are you? Oh, dear. Here we go again. I, Robin of Luxley. He really was a great fighter, a great champion. What happened? He had a medallion, a holy medallion given him by an old woman. He thought it was the medallion that gave him his power, his skill as an archer, his strength. Who did it? Who knows? He certainly thought so. Still does. He's not been able to do a thing right since he lost it, and that's for sure. He lost it? The sheriff took it. If it has any magic powers, they're working for him now. I see. And that's what he wanted to exchange me for, if I really had been the sheriff's niece. That's it, lass. This medallion, is it shiny and glittering? Ah, it is. Why, do you know anything about it? I don't know. What are you doing in these times? Ha-ha! <laughs> I travel throughout the kingdom, making potions and medicines. I travel from cottage to castle, bringing a little colour into the drab lives of the ordinary folk. With a bit of conjuring here, a few magic tricks. <laughs> See? Ha-ha! I still have some powers left, even if they are a bit weak and scrambled. I travel from lowly hovel to noble hall. Looking for the Nidus. Ooh, Nidus? Oh, the Nidus! I can't hold it, you know. Not in this existence. That's why we're here. To help you. Good, good. But are there not three of you? Yes, my sister Helen. She's disappeared. I see. I see. We must get away from here. I know where the Nidus is. You do? Indeed I do. Take care. In line. Come on, over there. Why'd you say they're spies? Well, he's a blackamoor, sir. I'm not blind. But, sir, he's a moor. I've seen them on the crusade. He must be a spy. Why else would he be hiding here in the castle? He's a boy. They're both boys. And this is the heart of England, not the Holy Land. Yes, sire. Enough! I... What were you doing in the cave? Playing, sir. That's right, sir. We were sheltering from the rain. We lost my sister, sir. And when we tried to look for her, he chased us and locked us in here. Games. Boys' games. And you? 
I know you, don't I? Yes, my lord, you do. You're the mountebank who gave my lady a potion for her aching neck. That's right. And how is her ladyship? None the worse. And what are you doing in here? Were you playing games, too? Me, my lord, bless you, no. I was allowed to uh, sleep here. Games? Sleeping? And you dragged me down here for this? But, sir, my lady Eleanor told me to go and find them. And now you found them? Release them all. Dunderhead! Get them out of here, now! Sir. Out of here, both of you. Back where you came from, and don't let me see you back here again. Rotho, you said you know where to find the Nidus. I do, I do. But we must be quick, or Bella will move it on again. But we've got to find Helen first. The Nidus first. We can't get it unless we're all three together. I know that. Leave everything to me. Trust me. <laughs> Come on, lads. You must find that girl. Girl? Did you not hear the lad talk about his sister? She must be found. They're a great danger to you if they're all together. Guard. Sir? There's a girl somewhere in the cave. We must find her. Aye, my lord. Why don't I use the power of sorcery that you gave me to bring her here to us? Because, my dear, I have better use for them. Now find the girl. Look! Bit of luck with the snares. Robin? Robin of Loxley? Aye. Marion told me about your medallion. Ah, oh, she did, did she? You want to get it back from the sheriff? Do I want to breathe? I may be able to help. You? Not just me. My brother and our friend as well. They're somewhere back in the caves. If you could help me find them, the three of us would be able to help you. Truly? How? When we're together, we have certain powers. Well, if they're there, I'll find them. No one knows those caves better than Robin of Loxley. It's a little way yet. What's that? This cave is said to be haunted. Ghosts? They won't harm you as long as you're with me. Are you sure? Sure. Quiet! <laughs> Great. Come along, don't dawdle. There's no time to lose. Where can they be? Keep going. Terry! Phil! Where are you? Somebody's coming. Quick, hide behind that rock. Listen. It's so dark, my lord. Yes. Let's have some light. There, my lord, look. Well, well, well. What have we here? I am the Sheriff of Nottingham. We've been looking for you, my dear. Your brother and his Blackamoor friend have been worried about you. Come with me. Uncle! Rowena, we have a guest. Her name is Helen, and she's travelled a great distance. Helen, you're welcome. Take care of her, my dear. I have other duties to attend to for the present. You must be the Sheriff's niece. I am. My name's Rowena. You the one who's going to be married? If my uncle has his way, yes. Don't you want to? Would you want to be married to an awful old goat with a smelly grey beard, old enough to be your grandfather? No. Nor do I. But I don't suppose I'll have any say when it comes to it. If my uncle wants something to happen, it happens. He's a very powerful man. He's a sorcerer. Yes, I know. How? I saw him light up a dark cave with just a wave of his hand. That's one of his simpler tricks. When he and that witch, Eleanor, get together... Eleanor? She's shuttle in here, no doubt about it. She rules my uncle like a queen. So what chance have I of thwarting his designs when they use sorcery and magic to get their way? Would... Would you like to take away his magic powers? Would I like? Is there a way? There might be. But we must be careful. Eleanor is the biggest danger. Stay close to me, lads. We're nearly there. Where are we going? To find the magic pole. Magic pole? Why? Because that's where the Nidus is hidden. Oh, of course. What about 
about Helen? Forget Helen! For the moment. Idiot boys, keep up, can't you? We're doing our best. Not good enough! Ah, here we are. Is this it? The magic pool. And Linus is here? You must look deep into the magic pool. All I can see is our reflections. You must look deeper. 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 Bello! <laughs> it wasn't Rothko. It was a trick. Bello conjured him up with Rothko's face. Come on, let's get out of here quick. The sheriff caught her. He nearly caught me too, but I, I couldn't do anything to save her. But I caught something else on the way back. A deer? A juicy partridge? No. Come on, Edgar. Robert! Why? I found him by the castle walls. He says he's a magician. <laughs> so I'm going to use him to help us fight the sheriff. Oh, don't be foolish, Robin. If he were a magician, he'd never let you tie him up. Come on, then, wizard. Release yourself! Untie me at once, you blithering, dundering jackanapes! I have been treating the sheriff's lady Eleanor for an ache in the neck, and he'll have you both flayed alive! You must not allow those children ever to be together. Then let me get rid of the girl. No. I will have things done my way. Keep them apart and you keep your power, understand me? But with one sweep of my sword, we could be rid of their threat. No, I tell you. They're agents of another. She is the one I want dead. The more he uses these wretches, the more he tries to help them, the weaker he becomes. And the two boys? Under control. I must see to them. Watch that girl well. Aye, Eleanor. said. Come on. We, we deny, deny you. you. Let's go. I'm Lady Rowena, the sheriff's niece. You clever girl, you caught her for me. No, she's run away. It's you. You know this man? Of course I know him. He's the reason I'm here. It's Rothko. What did you say? Rothko? Rothko. Ha-ha! <laughs> I am a Rothko. So, tie up Rothko, would you? Don't, Rothko. This is Robin of Loxley and Marion. They can help us. Hmm. Robin of Loxley, indeed. I found the Nidus. I know where it is. Nidus? You found it? Where? The sheriff has it. Wait a minute. There should be more of you, shouldn't there? Yes, there should. I don't know what's happened to Terry and Phil. Hmm. What about this, uh, Nidus? The sheriff has it, around his neck. The medallion? Yes, the magic medallion. I tried to touch it and did something strange. 
It bit me. Burned me. Eleanor, what about her? Is she there? Yes. She's Lady of the Castle something. Ah, so she is Eleanor. And you tried to get this medallion? Yes, we tried, but we couldn't. Rothko, you've got to do something. Well, I do have some powers, but... Uh, ah, Robin of Loxley. <laughs> there, Robin of Loxley. This will help you get the medallion back. An arrow? But how? You must shoot the arrow and hit the medallion exactly in the centre. Only then will it fall from around the sheriff's neck. One arrow, one shot. One shot. Oh, I don't know. I, I mean, I'm, I, I'm not as good as I used to be. You will be able to do it. You must. It's the only way for all of us. There's no way around it. We're stuck again. We just have to go through it, right? Come on. Ah, here we are. The dungeon. Now, you two wait here. Where are you going to? I have other things to do. Rothko, you can't leave us now. Have you forgotten your brother and Phil? But you said... We need them to get the Nidus away. Now, you two wait here. I'll find them. <laughs> Bello. Ah, Rothko. Your infant warriors are separated now. They can help you no more. Indeed. A bat. I ask you. Pathetic. What would you prefer? A dragon, perhaps? Better, if a touch banal. What? Why not turn yourself into stone? Forever. Ah, no, Rothko. You will soon be nothing. Understand me, nothing. Then I shall have the Nidus and rule our kind forever. You and your like have held power too long, Rothko. It's time things were changed. I shall rule with vengeance, and you fools will know it. No time or place will escape my commands. I shall create order throughout the universe. My order, at the pleasure of my will. My will, my will, my will, my will. Understand my will. Rothko? Rothko! Phil, we're not even wet. Crazy, crazy, like everything else. Come on, then, let's go and find... Rothko! Or is it? The one we met before was a fake invented by Bellor. I am no invention of Bellor. I am the one and only true Rothko! Ha-ha! <laughs> Come on, lads. I may only get one chance. Stay. Quiet. Move over there, away from the door. Quickly, put down your sword. Where's the sheriff? Up there. Call him. Call him. My lord sheriff, my lord sheriff! Tell him the girl's here. My lord, the girl, the girl's here! Luxley. Shoot! Shoot, Robin! I, I can't. You can do it, man. Shoot! There you see, as good as ever. Come on, lads. Helen, get round the medallion. Now, Nidus. It's the dagger. The Nidus is the dagger. Get round it quick. Death to you, Loxley! I deny you the Nidus. 